What you just heard was an excerpt of the new Raze menu theme by my good friend Martin, who has been hard at work. He has made four new music th tracks for the game, which is awesome, I think. I, I think the stuff he does, is, is it's amazing. It suits the game really well. So uh, if you're interested, I will link to his SoundCloud in the, in the description for this video. But so, we have been at work slicing up the main menu a bit, as you saw during the intro. So now you can actually navigate the the buttons, the menu buttons, with the key arrow keys. And I think in its current state you can do it with the joystick controller as well, so that's really great. You can you can navigate the menu without really... Or you can, you can play the whole game actually without even using a mouse and keyboard, just using a gamepad controller, which is what we intend for the final game. So let's get into it. Uh, I made a combo counter to the right, as you see. So it keeps track of how many hits you've landed in sequence. And that gives you credit bonuses, as I will hopefully demonstrate now. So here you see, the enemies actually, they position themselves around you, and they have little hit animations, so they can hit you now. Uh, and you lose infinitely small amounts of life currently, because the player the player health amount is too big. Oh, there you can see, this guy actually came above and surrounded me from the other direction. And they will try to balance out, so if I if I try to outrun them, they will, they will follow me from behind. So now I've gotten myself interlocked here in a deadly standoff with enemies from both directions. And they just keep knocking the living shit out of me, so I'm just gonna do a tactical retreat. Uh, and get absolutely wasted by them. Uh, there we go. Oh, so they still managed to follow me, follow me up here. Oh, uh, there we go. Finally get some peace. So, the the enemies follow me and attack me, and if I go down again, I have this little... <coughs> this little... Uh, I should say, placeholder attack animation, which is just composed of two sprites repeated over and over again. It's the, it's the beginning of the jump sprite, I think. So if I jump down and try to land a few hits, you'll see the combo counter go up. If I can, if I can even land a hit, there we go. And when it goes past ten, you see I receive a little credit bonus. So we thought about making it so that instead of receiving a credit bonus, bonus maybe you can you you unlock like a special attack that you can do for every ten or twenty hits that you get. You can probably hear my keyboard clicking away like crazy right now. So that's it. That's all that's been done this week, and I'm really proud of how much how much we've gotten done. As for next week, uh, I'm planning on getting. Well, for one thing, we're going to implement the uh, F mod audio system to get some sound effects in, uh, and hopefully, I'm also going to have made a proper proper attack animations for the player and started working on a system for chaining attacks together and doing special moves and finishers. So that's going to be really great. Down to, hopefully by next week we're actually going to see a playable version of the game. That you can actually... you have a little level and you have enemies that you could, can get through. So, to my first big announcement. We have a date for the first pre-alpha demo, which is going to be April 25th. In approximately two weeks from now. So it would be really interesting for me to hear what you guys think. If you if you want to try an early build of the game, just let me know. Either let me know in the comments, or, or if you know me personally, just send me a mail or, or whatever. Uh, just just let me know, and I'll send you a co uh, an early copy of the game. And please, it would be really fun to let me know what you think, and if you think it's fun. Oh, of course, I'm making it, so I know you'll think it's fun, but yeah, you know what I mean. But so, as for that... I believe that is it. Uh, see you guys next weekend, hopefully. I've been late a couple of weeks uh, in a row doing these videos because I've just had this so much stuff to do combined with sickness. But yeah, I'll try to be on time for next week. So, see ya!